Hey, this is Tom, CEO and co-founder of Buddy Boss, and in this video, I want to provide you with more updates on the new Buddy Boss app, what is left to launch, and what we're working on next. I will also provide you with an update on the Done For You service and the publishing service. Since we enabled the build system on March 17, we've seen hundreds of customers generate builds for their mobile app, and our DevOps team has been monitoring all your builds 24-7. We are seeing many of you begin to set up, configure, customize, and test out your new mobile app, and we are super excited to see that. Some of the apps I saw were beautifully customized, and I just can't wait to see these beautiful mobile apps in your members' and students' phones. The Buddy Boss team has been working around the clock to provide you with support, push out product improvements, and release the final components of the Buddy Boss app. And if you've encountered issues with the Buddy Boss app and have reported them to the customer support team, please note that the team is working around the clock to review the issues reported, find out if it's a product issue, or if it's related to a plugin conflict, misconfiguration, or server-related issue. Most of the issues we're seeing are related to plugin conflicts and misconfigurations. The BuddyBoss app is perhaps one of the most complex and innovative products in the WordPress ecosystem. And the fact that many of you already have established websites with dozens of plugins installed, it's easy to have conflicts that prevent some of the features to work properly. If you have features that do not work properly on your mobile app, You'll notice that if you do a fresh WordPress install, add BuddyBoss platform, the BuddyBoss app, and Learn Nash, the majority of the issues you have will be gone. Which means that although there may be some bugs in the product that need to be resolved, the majority of the issues we're dealing with are conflicts with other plugins or just misconfigurations. So if some of the features on your mobile app are not working as intended, please submit a support ticket so our team can assist you. When your ticket is received, our support team will review and identify the issue, and whenever possible, they will resolve the issue on your website. If the issue requires a product patch or if it needs to be escalated to our product team, the issue will be listed in our internal tracking tool and it will then be resolved in a product release. This week, we are releasing updates on the BuddyBoss platform, the theme, BuddyBoss app plugin, and the BuddyBoss mobile app. These updates contain numerous fixes that will solve many of the reported issues. And the team will continue to aggressively solve reported issues over the coming days and weeks, so you can expect the reported issues to progressively start going away. And some of you have asked questions about how in-app purchases work, and this week we're publishing all the remaining tutorials that will show you in detail how to use the in-app purchases feature. And last week, we published a tutorial on how to connect a Git repo for custom development with the BuddyBoss app. And later this week, we'll be releasing the developer access feature, as well as another detailed tutorial on how to do custom development on the BuddyBoss app. And we will add the links to the tutorials in the description below. The BuddyBoss app custom development feature allows anyone with developer access to build custom functionality into their BuddyBoss powered mobile app. And to support your custom development efforts, you also have access to the BuddyBoss app developer documentation, the BuddyBoss app custom development course, the API code reference, and the BuddyBoss app codex. And we will continue to update these resources as we continue to learn more about how you make use of this feature and how we can further support you in building custom features into the BuddyBoss app. The publishing component is also being released this week. We've already pushed out a product release that includes the publishing checklist and video, and in the next few days, we will push out another release which will enable the ability to submit a publishing request. Our publishing team will then start processing your requests later next week. This means that you can soon begin to submit your mobile app for publishing using our publishing service, and our team will assist you with reviewing your mobile app and submitting it to the app stores. For our done for you customers, we have now enabled the second and third questionnaires. You can now start filling out the setup and implementation questionnaire, and later this week, our team will begin working on phase two and phase three of the Done For You project. Keep in mind that the App Store graphics phase, which is the final phase of the Done For You project, can only be worked on once the setup and implementation phase is completed and approved. And just a couple days ago, on March 29th, we released access to the BuddyBoss app for the March delivery group, which means that if you purchase your app after November 23rd and prior to March 3rd, you now have access to the BuddyBoss app. And if your order included a Done For You service, you can also initiate your Done For You app project. So the BuddyBoss app is live, all the components will be live this week, and all the services will be fully operational later next week. The month of March has been intense for the BuddyBoss team as we work to release this massive and exciting new product, and we will continue to aggressively push out improvements to the product and services over the coming days and weeks. 
We had initially scheduled the launch of the BuddyBoss app for February 28th. We had prepared a cool landing page with a launch video to celebrate this huge product launch. And in that video, I had promised our early bird customers a free month on their BuddyBoss app subscription to thank them for their trust in BuddyBoss and for their patience as we prepared for the BuddyBoss app launch and as we rolled out the new product. And this was before we realized that we had to delay the release of the build system. So I still want to offer you the free month of the BuddyBoss app subscription. And this is my gift to you to thank you for your patience as we prepared for the launch and as we rolled out the BuddyBoss app to all of you. If you are an early bird customer and have purchased your BuddyBoss app prior to November 24, and your subscription started on February 28, then your subscription will renew 14 months later instead of 12. And if you purchase a monthly plan, your subscription will renew three months later instead of one month. And if you made your purchase of the BuddyBoss app after November 23rd and prior to March 3rd, and your subscription started on March 29th, then your subscription will renew 13 months later instead of 12. And if you purchase a monthly plan, your subscription will renew two months later instead of one month. And all the other terms and details remain the same. We thank you for your trust in BuddyBoss and we thank you for your continued support as we roll out one of the biggest and most innovative products in the WordPress ecosystem. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next update.